All right, so it is the afternoon of uh, day number nine here. Got a pretty late start out of Hot Springs today. Um, had an amazing breakfast. They really do a great job over there. It was quite elaborate. Um, got my resupply, made some repairs to my shoes, put a little video of them up there. Um, and by the time all that was done, it was about 11 o'clock, and that's when I started hiking north. And it's about 2.30 now, and a little over eight miles in for today. And the plan is, there's a shelter at mile 19, get at least to there, and we'll kind of see what time it is. Maybe, maybe do a few more. There's another shelter that's another like seven pass there. I don't think I'm gonna make it to there quite today, but that's fine. And also that means I'm officially um, off of my spreadsheet for the first time. My spreadsheet called for me to do 33 today. And to do that, I would have had to leave the hostel pretty early this morning. And I didn't want to do that. I had to sleep in and I did and it felt amazing. And I feel refreshed and the swelling in my feet has gone down a lot. And I feel recharged for this next section. Um, the plan is to get to Mountain Harbor Hostel, which I think is mile 394. So about 110 miles from where I am right now. And that I should be there in about three days. So tomorrow, the day after, the day after that, the day after that, I'll be there. Um, and I haven't decided if I'm going to stay there. I have a mail drop there or if I'm just going to kind of plug in for a couple hours and charge on. And the plan is to be in Damascus in six days. Well, yeah, June 6th. Today's June 1st. So hopefully that can all go according to plan. And hopefully we can continue having just this great weather. So. Yeah, we'll check back in later. Uh, good morning. It is day 10 out on the Appalachian Trail. Um, got in a little bit over 11 miles already this morning. Just had some breakfast at the Flint Mountain Shelter, which is where I was supposed to stay last night on my schedule. And then my schedule called for me to do a 40 today, which I think a 40 is just unnecessary to do that many miles um i would be sacrificing sleep to do to do one unless the terrain is significantly easier and if it isn't sure why not but you know it is important to be getting i think at least six hours of sleep so the plan for today um so from where i camped last night there was a shelter at about mile 30 which is not enough miles. And then there was a, the next shelter was at mile about 40, which is too many, I think. And there is a chance of some rain tonight, I believe. So I would like to be in the shelter, but neither of those mileages really make any sense. So I think I'll just kind of tent and batten down the hatches and hopefully the rain <laughs> won't be too bad and I can be a little bit more prepared and hopefully stay a little bit drier than I did the last time it downpoured in the middle of the night so all right good morning it is about 8 a.m here on day 11 so the plan for today is to do about another 34 mile day which will set me up to only need to do 30 to get into Mountain Harbor Hostel tomorrow. And then hopefully a couple of days and then be in Damascus Friday morning. And I haven't decided if I'm gonna stay in Damascus or just kind of roll through. I will need to have a full um, battery though when I leave Damascus. So that's one of the big things. Um, so I already have about eight miles in today and in about five miles we're going to come down to the Nalachucky River 
and Uncle Johnny is hostile and I'm going to hopefully plug in my phone, get some Wi-Fi, maybe download some podcasts, uh, hang out there for maybe 45 minutes, an hour, and then I should only have about 22 um, to do the rest of the day, which should be definitely doable. So that's the plan for today. And uh, it should be another beautiful day out here on the AT. So, um, so yeah, really excited to be out here. Everything's going going well. My feet hurt yesterday, especially towards the end of the day. But right now my feet feel great. No, no pain at all. So let's hope it stays that way. Also the trail so far this morning has been relatively easy, well built trail cut into the side of the mountain. So yeah, thing, things are good. Check back in later. Coming up on top of Umnika, I think that's how you say it, mountain. And this is a really unique summit with these pines. Haven't really had one like this yet. And it's really nice on my feet walking around all this soft stuff. Well, it is almost noon here on day number 12. Have almost 13 miles in for today. And the plan is to do about another 15 today, get down to US Route 19 and Mountain Harbor Hostel, where I have a mail drop and a reservation for bunk, so that'll be nice. Um, we are descending off of Roan Mountain right now. This is a pretty rocky part of the trail, usually when it goes over or close to 6,000 feet. And we may have just come down from 6,000 feet for the last time until New Hampshire. I have to double check, but I'm pretty sure that's gonna happen today. Um, so that's kind of neat, I guess. And yes, another beautiful day out here. And should be down into uh, Mountain Harbor by, I'm hoping between sometime between five and six would be good. That way you can have plenty of time to kind of get set up, get dinner, hopefully do laundry, which I have not done yet. Um, but yeah, the weather I think is going to take a turn for the worse for the rest of the week. So that will definitely add a whole nother dynamic because we've had pretty much nothing but beautiful weather. So, but you know, going into this, I knew it was going to rain at some point. So just have to embrace it and deal with it. So check back in later.